Good morning students. Today I am going to teach 9th maths 3rd chapter polynomials. Continuation of the previous video. In, in the previous video I have taught classification of polynomials based on degree. In Today I will teach classification based on terms. More than 3 uh, classifications are there based on terms. But we are studying only 3 uh, in this class. We are interested in only three classification in, in this class that are monomial, binomial and trinomial. <coughs> so what is monomial? Monomial means only one term will be there. Only one term. For example, 6x, 3x, minus 4x etc these are all only one terms right same way binomial means you will be having two terms okay so if you have two terms then it is called binomial for example um, 6x square plus 2x or 3x plus 5 like that etc see here two terms right here also Terms are separated by plus or minus symbol I have told. So here two terms, here also two terms. So binomial. What is trinomial? Trinomial means three terms will be there. Okay. Example 6x cube plus 3x minus y. See three terms are there. So it is trinomial. One more example. 3 terms means 3 terms means it is trinomial then what about this 3x square plus 5 plus 2x square what what is this which which is this cla uh, classification which class monomial binomial trinomial which is this so you might say that there are three terms are there so it trinomial you may say but it is wrong why why because you see here these two are like terms right variable having same power this is also same variable having same power right x square and x square so these two terms we we can add it right 3 plus 2 how much or we can write like this also 3 plus 2 will take x square as common and what is there 3 plus 2 then plus 5 okay what it becomes 3 plus 2 is 5 so 5 x square plus 5 so now how many terms are there only two terms make two terms means it is a binomial right so first we it is there were three terms so we may think that it might be uh, trinomial, but at last what do we got? Two terms, that is binomial. So whenever you are uh, this testing this, uh, which term it is, bi monomial, binomial, trinomial, you have to see whether it is in its simplest form. You have to see that it should be in simplest form. Then, other than that, we cannot simplify here. After this, we cannot simplify because these are unlike right not like terms you have to see if they, they if they have given any polynomial you have to see whether we can further simplify that if it was there in the last simplified form then you that time you have to see monomial or binomial trinomial understood same way like uh, one more example i'll give 3x square plus 7 minus 2 here while seeing three terms are there but See here, these two are constant, so we can simplify it, right? 3x square plus 7 minus 2, how much it becomes? Plus 5, so 3x square plus 5, so this is also binomial. Understood? So you have to, when you are checking mm, that, when you are checking, you have to see whether it is in its simplest form. If it is not there, you have to convert it to the simplest form, then you have to check which it is okay so that's all about classification based on terms next constant polynomial so we will have co what is constant polynomial 
name itself says constant a polynomial which contains only the constant for example I'll take a polynomial 7 this is a constant right so this is a constant polynomial in this book a polynomial which has only the constant no variable should be there or uh, sorry minus 6 this is also we can call it as constant polynomial or 5 or 12 and it, these are all constant polynomial itself it should not contain any variable if we take 12x this does not become constant polynomial because variable is there constant polynomial means only constant should be there like this okay only constant should be there that is called constant polynomial this is not and constant polynomial if we classify according to terms what is this monomial binomial or trinomial well, what it becomes only one term will be there right constant polynomial means see this is one one so only one term so it is a monomial so we can say constant polynomial is a monomial so every constant polynomial is a monomial whether every monomial is a constant polynomial no because uh, let me take one example 6x this is here only one term is there and it is a monomial right this is a monomial whether it is a constant polynomial no right because x is there variable is there if you have a variable then it cannot be a constant polynomial constant polynomial means only constants should be there so this is not a uh, constant polynomial so we can say every constant polynomial is a monomial but every monomial is not a constant polynomial what will be the degree of constant polynomial so this is a constant polynomials example right so this is a constant polynomial this is a constant polynomial so what will be the degree what I said if you have if you don't have anything only constant is there uh, along with that no variable is there means what it is understood what if you take this is a polynomial right it is understood x power 0 right what is x power 0 x power 0 means 1 so 5 into x power 0 means 1 5 into 1 is 5 so instead of writing this we are writing 5 uh, so this is a uh, constant polynomial right so degree what will be the degree 0 so degree will be zero so what and all is there in constant polynomial constant polynomial so every constant polynomial is a monomial and degree will be zero constant polynomial always always constant polynomials degree will be zero itself any constant if you take six or seven or eight or 13 anything so degree will be 0 that is x power 0 right so degree will be 0 itself for everything next zero polynomial what is zero polynomial a polynomial which contains only zero is called zero polynomial for example here zero zero is a zero polynomial let me take another example zero plus zero plus zero what it becomes zero itself so it is also this is a zero polynomial and what we can say about the classification based on terms only one term right so this becomes monomial all so zero polynomial is always zero polynomial is a monomial and what we can say about degree what will be the degree so if you take zero into x power zero what 0 itself 0 into x power 1 0 0 into x square 0 itself so we cannot say what is the degree can't be determined so what and all will be there in 0 polynomial 0 polynomial one is it is 0 polynomial is a monomial and what about the degree degree is does not exist exist or we can say can't be determined
students take down some homework questions classify the following as monomial binomial and trinomial first one x square plus x second one 2 minus x square plus x cube third one 5x fourth 7 fifth one 3x plus 4 minus 2x solve these questions in your homework book thank you